Hey everybody and welcome back to Jake Plays. Ah, trying to move my mic here. Alan Wake 2! Yay! We're back! Again! That little detour with uh Warhammer Space Marine 2, and now we're back. Yay! <laughs> I'm sorry. It's uh Okay, so, what is our objective? Oh. Plot board. Ah, I see. Okay, I'm trying to remember where we were. And where we go next. I guess we'll just... Okay, we can't. It could we... not be opened on the side. Okay, there we go. We're back. Hey, my God, he looks terrible. Also, I have a little piece of information between after after this is done. Well, hi, Mr. Door. I don't have time for this, so let's get it over with. Tell me. Hold on. That's better. Okay. I barely hear anything. Hold on. Ah! Okay. Was this all fake? A show? No one said otherwise, Mr. Wake. It was to indulge you, but... We can stop pretending now. Uh, masks come off. Oh, I wouldn't go that far. I don't even think you know who's under your mask. But you know how to make things difficult for yourself. There we go. All these rules. Endless, convoluted loops you insist on going through. You are so lucky. You know. There are so many people helping you. Armies of people. Myself. Your wife. Alice. I need to get to her. She's in danger. She is. Because of you. And so is someone important to me, someone you pulled into this. You keep opening doors, peeking in, reaching through to get what you want, and that puts you in my path. I don't know what you're talking about. I have to go now. Maybe you will make it through this time. This okay. has gone on long enough. This and our night springs, it was a nice distraction. It's time someone gave me a straight answer here. The next time we meet, the circumstances will be very different. And you would do well to return the favor by playing your part. Or stay out of my way, Mr. Wig. He scratch? What? Whatever you say. All right, well. Door, Zane, the masks were finally coming off. Was it a sign I was closer to escaping? I had no time to waste. I don't think I can get through there. No, I can't. No oh, shit. Everything is flooded. All 
right? Wait, why isn't the shotgun... hold on. Ah, oh, there we go. That's better. Oh, someone's out in there. You close, Tom. I bought a corn, but set the cranny in the snow. When the panic is biggest, the help is also near. Door didn't seem happy to see me this time. Fearing the master is the root of wisdom. But don't let the game get you down. He's playing his role. Maybe put him in your films, Tom, like you have put me. <laughs> what films? <laughs> I'm a fan of your masterworks. Uh, there is Tom the Poet, my favorite, and Uerden Uer is the most famous one, of course. And is it true what I hear? That it's coming back to the Thomas Zane is who he's talking about. Is there a bottom to this rumor? I need to get back to my apartment. Can you help me? Well, plan is half done. You asked me to make sure you won't forget the... the... Mikä se valokuva oli? The light, light pictures. pictures. The photos you artist wife took. Uh, they are waiting in the shoebox in the basement. All right. What you leave behind, you find in front of you. Okay. Thanks, Adi. I think. In the. I, 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 I'm looking forward to seeing you in the cinema. But first, I work. And the work won't end even when you do it, Melkel. I. Basement storage. Shoebox. All right. Oh, okay. Well, that was the end of the part then. All right. Well, not entirely sure. Let's refill. To get to Parliament Tower, I needed to find a murder site. Zane would know where to find one. Alright. Yeah, the, the phone. Okay, so does it mean let's go back to the hotel? Look for Zane at the hotel. Okay. Take the L. All right, time to go. Is 
Zane's room, 665, was upstairs. The elevator would take me there. Yeah, that's 665. Alright, well, we're gonna go find Zane. <coughs> Sorry. Oh, hey. It's nice up here. Oh, 665. Something told me Zane wouldn't be happy to see me this time. Ah! Ah! Oh, shit. I'm in control now. The second you try anything, I will shoot you in the head! Scratch wrote return, not me! You're a fucking liar! You've given up. You stopped writing. You said it was too dangerous, that, that we didn't deserve to get out. And then he showed up. Scratch. He promised to write. To get me the hell out of here. He was magnificent. A visionary. I mean, it was art. Hey, something funny about the scene. That's the same actor. By the way. I turn and left me behind. It's still here, and so is he. I know I fucked up. Yeah, you fucked up. But you can still catch him before he gets out. Before he gets to your wife. And when you get to him, don't hesitate. Kill the bastard for what he did to us. There's a murder site in my cinema where my film Nightless Night is playing. Oh, fuck. Damn. All right. Do not to try anything. Fuck. Ow. Bright light. Dark room. Ow. Fucking hurts. Zane's film. Intention eight. I had to find the movie theater poet cinema. The next murder site was there. Zane had created the film in tandem with Return to escape the dark place. Um. Okay, I don't think this was the way to go. Yeah, we're going to go back. The cinema. I need the elevator. Lovely music for such a horrible atmosphere. I mean, it was a great atmosphere, it's just it's, it's a horrible feeling. Nope. I could see the searchlight beams of the movie theater on the far side of the plaza. That's where we're headed, then. Holy fuck. Damn. 
Damn, all right. Fuck you, bitch. Let's move. It's dangerous to be out here. Hey. Hello. Hey, more ammo. Ooh, I don't like this. There are more shadows than they were the last time I played. That revolver does work. Like in a in a metaphysical sense. Yeah, more shotgun shells. The flashlight had done its job. Back the fuck up. I don't think they see me if I don't have the flashlight on. I think I remember that. Hey, look, it's been a hot minute since I've played Alan Wake. The cinema. Uh, nice try, fucko. Nightless Night. Thomas Zane. Oh, okay. So, do you remember Sheriff Breaker? Yeah. So, his face looked familiar to me. You know why? Because he played Iceman... In X in the old Fox, twentieth uh, century Fox X Men movies, he played Iceman. I just I didn't know that the until appeared to be closed. Until I did Even some research. Could still get me in. I was like, why does he look familiar? That's right, because he's fucking Iceman. Please enjoy the film, sir. Oh, hey, an echo. The cinema lobby was a gateway to other realities on the silver screen. I could set a scene here. The lobby. I felt like I'd been on this case looking for the cult of the word for a lifetime or more. The only case I'd ever been on. They would surface from the dark with their depraved acts of violence and fade back into the night, leaving behind bloody crime scenes and clues heavy with obscure meanings that led nowhere. Arriving at the cinema, I felt a monumental, terrifying revelation trembling before me. Ready to open its jaws and swallow me whole. Mm. This place had significance to the cult. There was something to use there. All right, let's go over here. This is staff. The question: How do you run from an idea, from a thought, from a story that lives in your head? You can't escape your fears. Ah. Shit. Uh. You carry your monsters with you. The devil will be back. It's in you. You're running right back to it. A loop. I have to stop. Stop running. Stop writing. I won't put another word. It's too dangerous. Only horror comes out of it. People get hurt. Okay. I would let the currents of this ocean wash me away. But what if I forget why I stopped? What if I forget I stopped it all? That is fucked up. If that happens, I'll start writing again. All right. Did I stop writing at some point? I can't stop. There's too much at stake. All right. Well, plot board. 
The main event was the murder. I had to find my way to it. The first step toward the murder site. I was making progress. All right. Someone had barricaded themselves in the room. So how would I get in there? The ladies' room. Hello. Cult of the word. Oh well. That's just fun. Whoa, okay. I wonder if something's behind this painting. Nope. Nothing behind the painting. All right, where do we go? Like rolling out the... Hello. Aha! Okay. Boom. Okay. So how do we... Oop. Staff only. Hello? I was missing something. Uh, yeah. Probably a key, if I just had to guess. Oh, fuck you. That's good. That actually scared the shit out of me. I was like, the fuck? Hello. Okay, so someone barricaded themselves in there. How the fuck do we get in there? So, all right, I know, I, I figured it out now. So what we just have to do is do this little funky number. And we're in. I'm the best. The talk. I'm gonna do you a lot of good to do you a lot of good to talk, buddy. <laughs> It was an initiation ceremony, and so we made our new members believe. Two of New York's finest, they had performed endless favors to earn their place among us. We had something special waiting for them. That's... And something very special for you, Alex Casey. That's... Who's your What's leader? his face? I forget. Alan Wake? Hmm? Scratch? Zane? Give me a name! <laughs> You will meet him soon enough. There was no end to the corruption. It fit the genre, so I'd use it. Okay. Anything else that's changing? Yeah, I like. Uh, fuck right off. Oh, shit.
still nothing over here. But now the door is open over there. Let's go upstairs. We've done everything here. Oh wait, we just went that way. All right, let's do this way. Hello? So both doors are open. Yeah, uh, hi. Both doors are open. Okay. Oh, hello. Urban legends. The urban legends circling Thomas Zane were a bottomless rabbit hole. I'd done some digging. To film Freaks, he was a mythic auteur in the art house cinema. A rising star coming to America from Finland. Finland. But he only created one film. Tom the Poet. Before he went missing. Mirroring the vanishing of the main character in the movie. Played by himself. The biggest mystery was around his lost film and early work made in Finland. Nightless Night, rumored to have mystic properties. Some claimed it was a snuff film, that the ritual murder in the film was an actual murder. There were no known right. surviving copies, but the cult chased it as if it were their unholy grail, just like Wake's books were. Hmm. All right, let's try some scenes. I am the child. Oh. not real. They're not real. Oh, God. The cops had gotten their 15 minutes of fame with the cult, and it had been a scream. They were the murder victims. 
I had to find a way into the projection booth somehow. All right. Changes shake the world around me. Okay. Hello. It's you following your master into La La Land. A sad bunch of clowns in funny masks and hoods pretending to be a secret society. Hmm. Well, maybe it is you who's playing a role, Mr. Casey. A role carefully laid out for you. A puppet blindly performing the ritual steps for the glory of the cult. Huh? What the fuck have you been smoking? <laughs> night, a clip of the lost film survived. You will see, Mr. Casey. In the nightless night, you will finally see. Nightless Night was Zane's film. It played a role in this story. Can't I move? shown out of the screen and revealed the door. Oh, hello. I was back out into the night. The seedy alley away from prying eyes was a good scene for dark deeds. What the fuck? You made it to the end of the video. I appreciate all of you watching, and if you like what you see, hit the like button. And if you want to see more of it, hit the subscribe button. And if you want to get notified whenever the new video goes live, hit the bell notification. And I'll see you all next time. <laughs>